Hey friends, I've got a grocery haul coming your way and I guess you could call this a two in one. Because I went twice to Walmart and I had two different hauls. So if you, if it sounds a little funny as you're watching, it's because it's from two different days. So I'm gonna go ahead and share and did I say it was from Walmart? I don't know. I can't remember if it's all from Walmart or if I had threw in a couple of things from another place. I'm not even sure because it's been a few days, so I don't even remember. So if you like grocery hauls, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't yet and share with people that you know that likes watching grocery hauls and tap that notification bell and that will inform you when I put up a new video and... Just enjoy this video and I will talk to you soon, guys. We picked up some more of these Butterball Turkey Burgers and they are the Sweet Onion Seasoned. And boy, we really liked those when we got them the last time. And I just went ahead and picked up another package. There's six in there and they don't shrink or anything guys and they are delicious and then down here we got some turkey bacon now i looked for the sam's choice and i couldn't see it there at walmart but they did have the gb which is walmart's brand so i just got one to try it and see if it's any good and then we like these real good Chicken nuggets right here. It's going to, it's kind of got a shadow on it there, guys. But they're chicken nuggets and they are 23 grams per serving of protein and th only three net carbs. And, and they're real good, guys. I, I really like them. I think Mark likes them too. But yeah, we got those. We got some more of these ham steaks. We fry those up in the skillet and that's some good protein. And then I went and picked up three, they're still frozen, three of these one pound of ground turkey, which we are trying Fletcher on some homemade dog food. He just can't seem to digest right. Any food that we get him that's in a can or, now he does eat some dry food, but we went ahead and got this three pounds of ground turkey. I fry that up in the skillet and put a little bit of olive oil, you know, drain it and then put it in uh, some olive oil in it for the fat. And, and then I take these um, mixed vegetables, which is, um, well, I see in this one, it's actually carrots, green beans, and corn and peas. We're going to try that, but last time I got him just the peas and I think it's carrots. So we'll see how that works out, but that usually lasts him. He gets a half a cup in the morning and a half a cup in the evening. Um, so we're going to see how that does for him. And then I got my favorite protein bars right here. Those are the Fit Crunch and they're the peanut butter and jelly. And they're a high protein bake bar. And they have 16 grams of protein and only one sugar. And they're 210 calories and they're gluten-free and made with whey protein. So I've got two of those. There's one back there. And then Mark's Pop was still on sale, his soda, for a dollar each. The Diet Mountain Lightning, it's like Mountain Dew. So he got, he picked those up. And then I got my Chabotis, uh Zero Sugar Vanilla Yogurt. I really, really like that. And did I mention that I got the, the chocolate chips? I like, I love these Lily's chocolate chips. I usually put some of those, and they are the chocolate salted caramel. And if you want a little treat, you know, it's, you know, next to ice cream for me. I really like it for a treat, and it's not as fattening. So I did get that. And then I picked up this grilled chicken marinara Parmesan meal. And it is the healthy choice. 
I picked that up. Let me look on the back and see if it tells. It's got 20, 21 grams of protein. It's at 280 calories and let me see. It's got 36 total carbs. That's kind of high, but I thought that would might be good. And then I got this mop and glow. Have you guys tried this mop and glow on your floors? It says it does uh, hardwood, tile, and, and laminate. So I'm hoping that it works on my floor. So I'm going to give it a whirl and try, guys, and see if it's good. And then, have you guys ever heard of that uh, lipoflavonoid? And they advertise it on TV. This is the uh, Walmart brand, the Equate. Uh, it's for inner ear health. I have vertigo sometimes, guys, and I think it's an inner ear problem. Well, it is an inner ear problem because I did see uh, an ENT, and he told me that I had vertigo, and it was an inner ear problem. So we got this for me to try to take to see if it helps with my spells that I have the vertigo, and we're going to give that a try. And then uh, one more thing over here before I show you this last thing. I found this really pretty melon looking. It's a waffle. Um, see that? See the material? It's a it's a robe. It's a lightweight robe, and I got it in a large at Walmart. And they had uh, different colors, but I really like this. It's a, like a melon color. I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know if I can hold it up and you can see it. I don't know. So, but it's really pretty. I I wanted to pick that up. I like just throwing on my robe after I get out of the shower. So I got that. And then we went to a place called St. Vincent, Saint, excuse me, St. Vincent de Paul. And it's like a Goodwill. And Mark found these shoes. He got a really good do, deal on those. They are, what is it? It's New Balance. Mm -hmm. And they weren't hardly, there. there's a, just a couple little tiny places right in there but other than that they were in pretty good shape and he got those I think he paid $4.99 for them but yeah he got those but I didn't find anything there guys so yeah so this is a continuation of Walmart and we've got some lilies milk chocolate style baking chips i got that for my yogurt and i really like this in the vanilla yogurt it's really good i uh, throw some of these in the vanilla yogurt and it tastes really good and i really like it so i got me some more of this lily's chocolate chips and then over here we needed some vitamin c pills and also I got some blueberries, some frozen blueberries. I've got a recipe. I want to make this uh, breakfast cake. It's like a, 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 or you can eat it like a snack, but it's uh, nutritional and it's healthy. And uh, it called for blueberries. So I got these frozen blueberries to put in it because it's only like a five ingredient. And then back here, I got some zero sugar and it's the coconut cream coffee creamer i'm going to try that and see if i like that and then we got some more protein bars and these are the mint chocolate chip cookie protein bars and they have 19 grams of protein in them and then the recipe that i was telling you about calls for the oat flour and that's one of the other ingredients in it i think it's blueberries oat flour uh sweetener of your choice like i normally use either monk fruit or something that's natural a sweetener and then there's eggs and the yogurt so and it you put it like in an eight by eight and bake it it's like a little and i think you can put them in like the little cupcake holders and make like maybe little um little muffins but we'll see i, I was thinking about putting it in a, like a um, a square casserole dish, which brings me to something else. 
Uh, over here, I did pick up a 8x8 casserole um, dish, a glass one, which I'm going to make the little cake in it. And then I got Fletcher this uh, mini little hedgehog, and he hasn't seen it yet, but I got him that little mini hedgehog. And I also got him some of these little crackers. They're little doggy crackers. They're uh, with peanut butter in them. And I'm going to see if he likes those. He's spoiled, guys. I'm telling you, he's spoiled. And then I got a dozen eggs over here. And I got me some more of the Chobani's Zero Sugar Vanilla Yogurt that's going to go in that recipe, which I shouldn't have to put too much sweetener because this has a, it's zero sugar, but it is a, has a natural sweetener in it. So we'll just see. I'll have to try one to see and just kind of uh, tweak it. Is that what you call it? Tweak it? And uh, tweak it? Tweak? I don't know how you say that. But anyway, we're going to try that. And then I got me a coffee. It's actually a travel mug 12 ounce um, coffee cup for traveling. And then over here, I got some teriyaki beef jerky. And then, of course, the baking dish here. And then we got two water refills. We get our water there at Walmart whenever their machine's not down. But we needed two refills, so we got two water refills. And then I got some more of this spray away, a double pack. Me and Mark's getting ready to wash our windows inside and out and I wanted to go ahead. I got two but they're not, I try to keep one in the kitchen and one maybe in my bathroom but I wanted to go ahead and stock up since we've got to do all the windows inside and out. So I went ahead and picked up a double pack of that and then I got two of this scrub free total bath room cleaner. It has OxyClean in it I got two of those, one for each bathroom. And then we got us a package of the jumbo size of the pork rinds, the barbecue. Mark likes the pork rinds better than I do, but when I eat them, I like the barbecue. So I picked up a, a, a big one of that. Guys, I have been missing things to show you guys in my hauls. And I think I forgot to show you these Yazzo. We got the Fudge Chocolate Crunch. They're 150 calories with four grams of protein and they're an ice cream bar. The ones that we got, we, that we tried, I think they were like a, had caramel in it or something, but we picked out this one to try. So I'm sorry I forgot to show you.